What's up YouTube? My name is Vienna Sky, and if you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe. Because of recent circumstances, I have had to move home. So I am redoing my bedroom completely, and a whole video about the room transformation will be coming soon on my channel. But today I figured I would make a separate video on how to make the foam mirror, because these have been very trendy recently, and I've seen a lot of images on Pinterest when I was looking on ways to redecorate. So that's what we're doing. It's really easy, so let's go. So you need a mirror, I'm using a round mirror, and then you need expanding spray foam. This I just ordered from Amazon, but you could get it at like Home Depot, any of those stores. So I have just laid this mirror on the box that it came with, but you could use a tarp or something. But this is just so you don't get any foam on the surrounding area. I feel like this stuff might be toxic because it says to cover your eyes and cover your mouth. So here we go. It says shake for 30 seconds. I feel like I'm the Paradise Bartender, like shake, 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 shook it up a little bit and then you just squeeze this and it doubles in size so you just have to do like a little bit oh ah. god this stuff is weird oh i mean i think that looks pretty good you do like a little bit because it's supposed to double in size overnight so i just let that cure I'm a professional, so I know all the right words. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I should do, because it looks really cool, and I feel like I could add more stuff, but I don't know what. Oop, it's getting in my deck. Basically, I just remembered that I have three smaller mirrors, so I'm cleaning those now, and then I'm going to spray them so that I could kind of assemble the big mirror and then the three smaller mirrors next to each other, because I feel like that would look really cool. What's up, Sky Squad? Welcome to part two of DIYing these mirrors. So, you want to be in my video? Okay, so my dad is making a special appearance, but basically, hey, what's that? So the mirrors have dried, and today I'm going to paint them. I have a lot of acrylic paint that I just picked up from Michaels. Do you want to help me? I'm curious what you're gonna do. Whether I want to get covered with paint or not is another story. For the big mirror, I want it to match my pillow and my curtains, which are this color. So I think I might have to mix a few of the paints together. And I'm not the most artistic person, but let's see how that turns out. So right now, I just ripped up a bunch of paper and put it underneath the foam to avoid dripping the paint onto the mirror. And then I went ahead and painted the mirrors, but one tip is don't use a brush like this. Um, it's easier to just use a regular paintbrush. I thought that the sponge would be better, but it's honestly not. Now, all my mirrors are painted and dried, and I'm just adding a gloss top coat, and then we're going to set them up. Do you need help? Wait, you mark it. I don't know how accurate this is. That's fine. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you stay tuned for my full room makeover video. And if you enjoyed this, make sure you subscribe to become part of the Sky Squad. Thank you guys.